it's got a big split in it. So we have these two carrots uh, that we're going to put in our stew, and they're uh, they're not very good quality. We bought them in a bag, and uh, we're going to have to use them because we uh, don't want to waste the food. Yeah, we don't have that much to use. Yeah, at least how do you usually uh, prepare a carrot? I peel it. Mm. Um, I also buy it. Um, I'm buying the miniature ones oh, well, if I wanted to snack. Mm. Um, so those are probably like three times more than this, yeah. I think. Um, sorry, I am so tired right now. Mm -hmm. um, I'm definitely feeling the limited amount of food in my system. Some um, spices and flavors to it. Carrot. Considering. Hmm. It's just spice to that. Yeah. We added a couple of cents, basically, value. Um, so this is two carrots, two servings of beans, a quarter of an onion, a shake of cumin and turmeric and stuff, mm -hmm. some rice, and half a chicken stock cube. Uh huh. Makes the difference in the world. Mm. A lot better than our porridge. Mmm. I'm gonna get so sick of porridge. I'm gonna get so sick of it. I've definitely found cooking things in bulk is good. Mm-hmm. With two people. Have, oh, yeah, with two people. Mm-hmm. Oh, you could sort of imagine having to feed a family. That would be really, really tough. Mm-hmm. Mm. A lot of the um, the people that Build Africa supports. Um, will cook for a dozen people. And I guess in that scenario, if you weren't quick, then you might lose out. Mm-hmm. Yeah. On your share. Uh-huh. Especially if there are lots of kids around. Mm-hmm. Mm. Yeah. So, interesting. Elise right. and I won't be having a nighttime standoff over the uh, beans, hopefully. <laughs> Thankfully. <laughs> 